Okay, cool. That's our safe word. All right. Yes, We're good? Please. Yes, please, daddy. <laughs> Hello, mountain bike world. It is the month of November 2020, and we are going to tell you the trending mountain bike products this month amongst a ton of other cool surprises. And we hope you're full and stuffed and ready to learn about mountain bike parts and had enough turkey on Thanksgiving. Hey, that's my turkey, boy. Before we dive into the trending products of the month, I have two very important quick announcements I wanted to tell you. Number one, I got a new bike this month. It's a Rebel Ranger. I'm very, very excited about it. Uh, a lot of you have seen it on Instagram and we will be making a new bike day video where I talk about why I built this bike and all the little unique quirky little things I did with it, including cutting off the 50 tooth on the Eagle cassette right here. So it's kind of an interesting weird story that a lot of people freaked out about on the internet. So I'll tell you about that later. Number two, currently we're doing a Black Friday, Cyber Monday reverse sale. Uh, this year, the supply chain has been decimated because of the pandemic and the vast majority of our catalog and frankly, everyone in the entire bike industry's catalog is very much out of stock. Not entirely, but a lot of it is. So it seemed like a rude thing to have a sale when there was such bad inventory levels across the industry. So instead, we decided to set a goal of raising over $10,000 for NICA, the National Interscholastic Cycling Association, which is the nonprofit organization making mountain biking a legitimate sport in middle schools and high schools all across the country with over 25,000 riders. So we are discounting gift cards by 10%. Each one sold, we donate $5 to NICA and every product on the site, we've added an additional $5 to, so every product sold $5 goes to NICA. So trying to raise $10,000 in awareness of what the nonprofit of NICA is because it's amazing what they're doing, getting kids all over the country on bikes. All right, so now into the products. First up, we have the SRAM GX Eagle 12 speed chain. This sucker is $33 free shipping from us and it fits all Eagle drivetrains, whether that is SX, NX, GX, X01, XX1, or the access stuff. Uh, a lot of cross compatibility between Eagle, including the chains as well. So you can use this for any Eagle drivetrain you have. Very nice, high quality chain. Jared, what Eagle drivetrain do you have on your bike? Let's see, Jeff. Well, on my Yeti SP150, I've got a XX1 chain actually, but with a GX shifter, GX trailer, and an X01 cassette. It's like a, you know, little hodgepodge. Mixed, yeah, hodgepodge, hodgepodge mixed bag. Smorgasbord. Of, smorgasbord. Of, it's like a German meal where you eat the food, right? Yes, it's like a, I don't know, like a charcuterie. We're getting off topic. Next product. Next up. Muckoff Dry Lube. This is the best selling chain lube this month for $9.99. Uh, Muckoff as a brand is making a ton of really good products these days lubricants, cleaning supplies, all sorts of other stuff. So make sure to check out all the different various offerings. Dry lubricant, you say? Oxymoron? No? Lube? Dry? Let me explain, sir. Hmm. It's a dry lube because it's chain lubricant meant for dry conditions. Hmm. Interesting. Makes sense. Wet lube. For what conditions? There we go. Ah, precisely. <laughs> <laughs> if you have air suspension on your bike, chances are you need a shock pump, just like this RockShox one here. It has a 300 PSI analog gauge, a thread-on Schrader valve, and also a bleed valve right here. So in case you happen to exceed the pressure, you can just back it off a little bit, just like that. What's the price? $35, why do you ask? Because we also sell a Fox one for $31.99 with the same features. What? Hmm, does it have a analog gauge that goes up to 300 PSI? Exactly the same. Does it have a blow off valve right here, just in case you happen to exceed the desired yep. pressure? Yep. What about a thread on Schrader? Yeah. Does it have a nice glidey shaft here for smooth actuation? It's pretty smooth. I think it's smoother than that one. Let me try that one. You try this one. Yeah, yeah. 
Oh, that is smooth. This one's smooth too. Hmm. They're both nice. We could put some dry lube on it perhaps, make it even smoother. Let's give that a try. If you have a stock DT Swiss ratchet driven hub on your bike, chances are you probably want this next product. This is the DT Swiss 54 tooth ratchet kit upgrade. It comes with the ratchets, the two springs, and basically a lifetime supply of the special grease. Uh, the reason for this upgrade in particular is because of that dead zone when you're pedaling is the engagement that you're lacking. And we made a whole video about the pros and cons of the engagement and why you really want that 54 tooth upgrade kit. So. $107, probably the best hundred bucks you'll ever spend. And like I said, this works with all of the ratchet driven DT Swiss hubs. If you like night riding just as much as I do, then you're probably looking for a light to use when you're riding at night because it's getting dark earlier. You can't just go pedal out and go for a ride after work like you used to when we had those long summer days. So, looking at night lights, this is the Night Rider Lumina 1200. This is one of my favorite lights. Probably, if you're gonna use one light, this is a good one to use. Throw it on the handlebar with the included mount. This one is $109.99. We actually did a video last year where I tested all of the different lights, makes and models, and this turned out to be one of my favorite ones. Super easy to use, just a few different modes, cycling through the lowest to brightest, and there's also a daylight flashing mode, which is nice if you're out on the road and want to be seen by those tricky vehicles out there. <laughs> and also, check out that video below in the link. We've got to keep our composure! We've got too far! Check out the link below in the video description for that video. God <laughs> Oh my God. Yeah, is this, is this a good one? How's that? Is this good? Is that good? Do we look so Do we look sober? Do we... Does his back look broken? I broke my back. Doctor said I need a back behind. <laughs> Spinal. Thank you very much for watching thus far. Please do hit our website over the next couple days. Uh, we really do want to raise over $10,000 for Nika. Watch that video we did about what Nika is and why specifically we're doing the fundraiser and why we think mountain biking is impactful. Thank you. Happy Thanksgiving. And what else? Have a great night. Eat lots of turkey stuffing, mashed potatoes, gravy. This is coming out three days after Thanksgiving. Oh, shit. Oh, Eat the leftover. <laughs>